Well, I hope you have learned something here. The Indian Wars are over by 1890, and I hope I have given you some good views of the terrain in and around the battlefield. And if you have never been here before, hopefully you'll get to come out here sometime. And if you have been here before, hopefully you will come back and you will look at the event without fatalistic eyes. And just remember that uh, this isn't a battle where you take sides, you know, good versus evil. You can't do that. The Indians were trying to preserve their way of life, and they were trying to protect their family members, the women and children. And the soldiers were out here carrying out orders from their superiors. So it is very easy to pick sides, but you should not try to do that. It isn't good versus bad, like I said. This event is a tragedy in American history, and a lot of young people on both sides died when they really didn't have to. It is an unfortunate thing that happens in history. But the good thing about the event is that you have the park rangers and the amateur historians like myself, and we are able to take what started out as a negative and are able to learn from it and turn it into a positive by telling the story. So hopefully you have learned a few things and you have enjoyed yourself during this long documentary. And also, just to note, uh, don't take anything that I have said as gospel. I have interpreted the information and the story that I am giving you is my interpretation from authors, historians, geologists, and other historical documents. So uh, please do your own research and come up with your own conclusions. So this is the end of the documentary now, and it is September 2010, and we will finish off with a look here at Last Stand Hill with the Soldier Monument and the mass grave of the soldiers underneath. And like I said, please come out here sometime and see the terrain for yourself. Until we see each other again, thank you for watching, and have a good day.